How's it going guys and welcome back to Finding Charizard and yes we're back with another video today and this time around I've got some investments for you guys that are all under £25. Not only that though guys there is a giveaway as well for this beautiful Dust Noir graded 8 car. Now if you want to enter the giveaway stick around towards the end of the video and I'll tell exactly how you're going to enter it. Oh my god! Now I have got some products, five products in total that I'm going to be talking about in today's video. Some products that I think are very, very good pickups, considering with the packs inside and the types of products that they are, they could be very good little investments. So the first product we're going to be talking about is the Series 7 Pokeball. Now I've never even really bothered about collecting these Pokeballs, but I am going to be looking to get a couple of these Pokeballs in for sure, because inside the Series 7 Pokeball, you can get yourself a Cosmic Eclipse booster pack. Now, Cosmic Eclipse for me is one of my favorite sets. I absolutely love Cosmic Eclipse. I wish I collected more of it at the time, I really do. But you've got some amazing cards, like this statue card, for instance. That would be an amazing card to pull from this set. And obviously, with this Cosmic Eclipse pack, who knows, you might get lucky and pull that beast. The Cosmic Eclipse booster pack, so they actually resell for eight to 10 pounds on eBay. I've got all these prices from eBay and other online stores so I can give you the guys the best prices that I can find. So not only that, Cosmic Eclipse was actually released in 2019. So it's, you know, three years old. It's kind of older set now, but it had so many chase cards in it. You had the Blastoise, the Venusaur, and the Charizard Rainbow Rares to go for as well. It really was a fantastic set. It had a lot of nice high value cards within as well. And definitely like a product and a set I'm keeping an eye on and maybe start collecting with individual packs but you can actually get this Pokeball off eBay for $14.99. So I'm very tempted to go and get one, well, I say one, I'm gonna get a couple of these Pokeballs and uh, definitely have them in the, in the collection and see how they perform over the next few years. Now, one of my favorite boxes that I've spoken before about quite a few times on the channel, but I can't get away from it because the deal that you can still get for this Pikachu V box is still fantastic. From Chaos Cards, you can get it for 17 pounds 65 pence and with its packs inside, it's got two Brilliant Stars booster packs. It's got Chilling Rain and Fusion Strike. Now, Brilliant Stars booster packs, Charizard's Galore, Trainer Gallery set with the Umbreon as well. Fantastic cards all around. The Alt Art Charizard, definitely a card to keep an eye on. As we've seen so much hype around alternate art cards in general, I think alter alternate art cards are gonna start climbing in value for sure. And obviously this being a Charizard is a beast of a card. But not only that, you've got the V-Star Charizard to go for and the uh, other regular V-Star Charizard, the Rainbow one being one that I've got two off, which I've got one at PSA. So fingers crossed it gets a 10. Not only that, you've got Chilling Rain, which is another fantastic set for pound for pound cards. There are some very, very high value cards like the Glarian Moltres and the Blaziken as well. Very, very epic cards inside. And Fusion Strike, a very underrated set as well. You've got the Gengar cards, you've got the new cards, You've got the Espeon card as well, and there are some very valuable cards within all of these sets that are provided in this Pikachu box. But not only that, it's a Pikachu box. It's a mascot Pokemon box. And obviously it being Pikachu, there's Pikachu collectors. People want to get these Pikachu boxes and the promo cards to go with it as well. You do have a nice Mimikyu promo card. There is like a following of Mimikyu. A lot of people do like Mimikyu as well. But yeah, you get a nice little hollow card to go with it as well. Next up, you have the Boutland V box, another fantastic box. And the deal I've got for you for this is for £16.95. So these boxes at retail were $21.99, as well as the Pikachu V box. And obviously these prices are considerably under that $21.99. Now in this box, you've got a slight difference in your packs. You've got two brilliant stars and you've got Evolving Skies and Fusion Strike. So in this box, we don't have the chilling rate but we have Evolving Skies, arguably the best set from Sword and Shield. And fantastic set, you've got Moonbrons you can be trying to go for, different Rayquaza cards. You know, we all know the madness of Evolving Skies at the minute, it's absolutely everywhere on YouTube and so it should be, it's an amazing set. But not only that, the whole box and the pack selection is fantastic and definitely one I'm gonna be picking up, especially for that price from Chaos Cards. Don't need a gun to get 
Now the next box I'm going to be talking about is the Galarian Rapidash box. Now this is a box that has been reprinted recently. It's a actually really nice box art. I actually really get around it and I've collected one so far. I got it from my local game store and I got it for $21.99. I haven't seen it anywhere cheaper than that because inside this you also get a Cosmic Eclipse pack. When this box was first released it had a different variant of packs probably not as good as what we're seeing now. So you could argue it's a fantastic reprint that it's had. So in this box, you get two Vivage Bolsters packs. You can be going for a Chonky Chew. And I actually really get around Amazing Reds. I actually think Vivage Bolsters gets a bad rap. Uh, I do think in general, we could see Vivage Bolsters do better in the long term. But in this box, you get Evolving Skies as well. So you get Cosmic Eclipse and Evolving Skies and two Vivage Bolsters packs. That is a pretty nice pack selection. Um, whether you like or are a big fan of Vivage Vultures, there aren't so many high value cards in Vivage Vultures, but for me the box is made up because you get an Evolving Skies and a Cosmic Eclipse pack as well. Now the next box is a fantastic box as well. Another collection box I have for you, but this time around it is the Orbital V box. Again, this has had a reprint as well, but we have some fantastic sets in this as well. We, this time around we have got two Evolving Skies booster packs and that is pretty amazing to go with with two Evolving Skies booster packs, as well as a Vivid Voltage and Ultra Prism booster pack as well. So we've got a really nice collection of um, booster packs and we've seen a slightly older booster pack in the Ultra Prism as well. Now, one of the best cars from Ultra Prism, if you're not up to date with your slightly older sets, is the Lily Trainer card. It's a fantastic card, beautiful artwork on this card. And this is actually like a 230 pound card. And it's definitely one that you should be chasing with these Ultra Prism booster packs. And another fantastically valued card is this Cynthia card. Again, you can pick this card up for like 103 pounds. And it's definitely another chase card from Ultra Prism. I haven't actually opened up a lot Ultra Prism myself. I kind of was kind of in and out of Pokemon at that time when Ultra Prism was released. But it's definitely a set that I'm going to be coming back to because it does have some nice valuable cards within the set as well. So that is my list of Pokemon products under £25 that I think you should be invested in. Tell me what you think in the comments section below. If there's any other products that you think I could have mentioned, do let me know. I'll be curious to see your thoughts as well. But for me, I think these are all solid boxes that could do very well in the long term. Obviously, we've got some reprinted box, which is really, really nice to see. And they've had strong reprints with some fantastic pack selections as well. Given that there's a few Evolving Skies been thrown in as well, it makes it very, very more collectible and probably sellable in the future. Like I said, guys, we have this up for grabs for a giveaway. This is a worldwide giveaway. Anyone can take this card. All you have to do if you want to enter this giveaway, though, guys, is subscribe to the channel, like today's video, and tell me in the comment section below what your favorite psychic Pokemon is. Before I go, though, guys, thank you for watching today's video. Do leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And I also have a Patreon. If you want to be more involved within the channel, you can sign up to my Patreon services as well. But as for now, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys again soon.